Joey, have you ever been involved in a game where you scored six touchdowns? This, this is definitely my first game to score six touchdowns. What kind of a uh, place does this have in your football career? Uh, this is probably one of the best games uh, of my entire career. Playing in this this type of a game against a team that was 2-0 and, and seems seemingly untouchable. And, and so to come out and play like that, I have to give thanks first to, to God uh, for giving me the ability to do something like that. And, uh, and to the rest of my teammates, obviously, they were they were in front of me the whole time blocking for me. Another unusual thing, 107 points. Uh, if somebody told was? you your, your defense would give up 50 points and you still come out winning, what would you have said? Uh, I would have said that we played a great offensive football game. <laughs> Uh, I mean, yeah, it just took a great effort by all of the guys up front. Uh, I have to give praise to them because without without them, nothing moves. So they're the wheels on our bus, and, and uh, they really make it go. This is going to take a lot of, ana a lot of ana analysis. I hope we can say that correctly. Um, but shortly after the game, can you, can you tell us what the difference was between the two teams today? Uh, not very much. Seven points to, be, to uh, the way it looks. But I think that uh, it was just a couple of plays. It's the same thing I was saying about last week in the Raiders game. So they made a couple plays and we didn't. And in this game, we, the ball bounced our way. And, and you know, that's how the game's played. You can't, uh, you can't win them all. You just have to keep playing good football. And, uh, and sometimes you come out victorious. Uh, just tell us what happened on the kick return touchdown. It was, I mean, on this field, it's not quite a 100-yard uh, return, but it, it was out of the old end of the end zone. It was in the end zone? Yeah, it was two yards in, in, into your own end zone, so it must have been about a 96-yard return. Uh, can you just tell us how that worked out? Uh, I just, I found a seam in the opening, and I made, I made it to the outside, and that's that's the first goal, and then I, felt, I saw a convoy of white shirts. They're all out in front of me, and I just tried to follow behind them. Three kick return touchdowns for the Dragons in three games. Uh, that's pretty unusual too. Um, what makes, makes the kick return team so strong? It's, it's guys that have no fear. We have got a group of guys that fly into bodies one-on-one. -on -one. They don't care. And all you have to do as a kick returner is just sprint. And if they're if they're running into people, then those guys can't tackle you. And then you just try to outrun the rest of them. And I haven't even mentioned the punch return touchdown show yet. How did that work out? Uh, you know, I... My coach doesn't really like me to catch the ball and keep it in my face, but I, I, I just I like to I like to see what happens, roll the dice a little bit. And so I caught it and made the first two guys miss, and then once again I saw white shirts and ran towards them. Uh, no harsh words after that touch. Right? Uh, harsh words from the coach. Actually, it was a little bit of a high five, but <laughs> when it works out well, then there's no harsh words. So no yes, no yes. Right, exactly. Um, could this be the start? Something big for the Dragons this season? It, everything works on momentum. And so, yeah, we've got some great momentum coming off of this huge win. And I really hope that it rolls us in the next week and then, and then we'll play the Giants again. And, and uh, we can get this thing going for the championship. Okay, we'll be the first ever for the Dragons. I'm excited to try. Okay, good luck. Thank you very much. Thanks, guys. Go, Joey! <laughs>